So in this session, what I want to do is to draw on some of the work we've been doing with business, corporate clients, individuals, NGOs around the world to help them understand the forces shaping the future, understand how things might change as a result of the pandemic or in response to it, and really understand how do we shape our world? How do we deal with the kind of radical changes of the nature that you're talking about in this conference and that the other speakers are discussing? Next. And what we see is that I've been to a lot of conferences in this sector. I've talked to a lot of people. I've read a lot of stuff. And there's a constant conversation, which is how do we broaden out from being well respected within a niche to making this a whole of society dialogue so we can get more people involved, broaden our customer base, increase our investment opportunity, and really scale up to fulfill the potential of this opportunity. And also that means how do we move from a conversation internally within the sector around what are the possibilities and what's the science and technology that enables that to one that's increasingly about what does the audience want to hear? They want to understand the impacts of this, how it will change their lives, how it will change their businesses, what it means for their country, what economic and social impact could it have? How does it impact health systems? So that's what I really want to focus on in, in this session. Next. And what we see is as we, as we try and understand the future, there are many, many forces at play and many, many ways in which they could interact and play out i.e. multiple possible scenarios. And I think we're moving now to a point where the industry has to understand what those scenarios are post pandemic, because they have a big influence on what the size of the market could be, what kind of investment opportunities might come our way, and how we commercialize on all this incredible science we're doing. 